All right, so yeah, lawnmower in the distance, air conditioner, and uh, pink chair. Don't care. Cue the intro. What is up everyone? It is the endorsement and it is time for another review. This is where I try something and tell you if you should like it or not. I can be very persuasive. Melodic sounds of a lawnmower in the distance, more in the distance than it was uh, when I started. That's a good sign. Uh, hopefully the air conditioner will go off soon. We have a lot happening. Should be a quick video. I'm trying to mix it up a little bit like I do. I see something at the store that I want to try. I've been knocking out the fast food game for a long time, past couple weeks. Fast food, fast food, fast food. I try to hit you with some stuff from the grocery store. So I found this at uh, Walmart. They have three new flavors of Snapple lemonade. So this one is the watermelon lemonade. This one is the Black Cherry Lemonade. It says new. I think they both have been out uh, since the beginning of the summer. Perfect for the summer. Snapple and the summer. Uh, the third flavor is Pineapple Orange? Pineapple something. I looked all through the bin. It's like, uh, what did they have going on? It was like the huge bin with these just kind of stacked and piled all in it. It reminded me of like Walmart's version when you try to get the $5 DVDs. You know, you pull it out, you're like, oh, look at that. Uh, I don't know, uh, what's one? Roadhouse. Patrick Swayze. Yeah, ghost like Swayze. But all right, let's get into this. Which one first? Which one first? Which one are you thinking? I know, you're thinking. Which one am I going to go to? We're going to go watermelon. Watermelon first. Let's pop the top. All right, wish me luck. Watermelon lemonade from the folks over at Snap. I'll be honest, not what I was expecting on the first set, second set. Ooh. I don't know. I was just about to compliment Snapple and be like, you know, these are going to be fire because they normally hit on all cylinders with flavors. But something's going on here. A, it feels a little watered down. B, it's not as sour or even sweet that I was hoping for a lemonade. And the watermelon flavor is... What's that? Oh, chicken wing right there. Um, the watermelon flavor is like muted and almost chemical a little bit. Third set. Little bit of a pucker at the end, a little bit of a lemonade pucker, but uh, initial thoughts, not a huge fan of that. So I'm not even sure if you need the shake up Snapple. Do you need the shake up Snapple? Oh, I don't see it. I don't see it. 10% juice uh, from a blend of lemon, cherry, and grape juices. Grape? So they got grape juices, but it's just a straight up black cherry lemonade. Pop it. I like that though. Let's give this a smell. Now, straight off the bat, I'm not a huge fan of cherry. Cherry flavoring. Nah, not a huge fan, but the wind's kicking up. The wind is picking up, so let's get right on with this. Uh, whoa, it's like 20 mile an hour. Yeah, 20. Something seems off. Something seems off. These are a dollar a piece at Walmart, but again, almost a chemical taste to the cherry. Smell was on point, and I'm missing lemonade. I'm missing that sweetness. I'm missing that pucker. I mean, it's there. I mean, it's not just straight up black cherry, but nah, nah, nah. All right. I'll rate both of these, but woo, a little disappointed. On a scale of one to 100, with one meaning, don't even waste your money. And 100 being the promised land of, I'm going to give the black cherry. We'll do that one first since it's uh, still on the taste buds. Whoa, text message. Uh, I'm going to give the black cherry lemonade Snapple a rating of, I don't know, this is like a, I mean, I'd finish it. It's a hot summer day. Um, I'm just keeping that real. That's a 50. 
I mean, it's liquid. I'll keep it in the fridge, maybe sip on a little bit. Or who knows? I honestly, I might not finish this. Huh, that was uh, intriguing. So on the same scale, 1 to 100, I'm going to give the watermelon lemonade a rating of... Oh, which one did I like better? 49. I think I like... Whoa, how did I even say that? I like the black cherry flavor a little bit better. This seemed more watered down, had less of the flavor, and uh, I still was not a fan of it. So that gets a 49. But uh, yeah, hated to do it to you, Snapple, but come on. That is not lemonade. That is not a half and half type of beverage going on for me. I was hoping for half black cherry, half lemonade, half watermelon, half lemonade. I came up with something totally out there. Yeah, not a huge fan. So uh, there you go. Another review in the books. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, please do not forget to check me out on Instagram and Twitter. That is social media getting the word of my channel out to the masses. In closing, I don't know, would the pineapple orange or that other uh, flavor, oh, lawnmower's done, uh, been better than these two, but uh, yeah, so what are we talking here? 150 calories per bottle, um, all natural, I don't know, something is just off on this. Let me know if you've tried these, are you a huge Snapple uh, drinker? Uh, these things were huge, what, in the 90s, uh, they had, what's her name, Debbie, Debbie the Snapper girl, Snapper. Debbie the Snapple Girl, I think that was her name, it was in all the commercials, but uh, yeah, that's it. I'm rambling now. Uh, I had to do something to make this uh, memory of these flavors go away, and uh, that's it now. All right, bonus footage, uh, quick little bonus footage, I guess, even the backyard reviews, when you get off the porch, still gonna have uh, lawn mowers going, and like I said, right next to me, it's right, it's right there, off camera, it's the star of the show, air conditioner, just circle, doing its thing, and literally it was off, and then it just started as I sat down to uh, film, so 